Hi, uh, I'm Jonas. I, uh, I'm running my own mail server, and as I'm running my own mail server, I would like to uh, get informed when it breaks down, because if my mail server is down, I cannot receive any mail, which is not good. For that, I've implemented this little uh, thing, the mail exporter, which basically what it does is... Oh. <coughs> Forget the, Sorry. the microphone. Huh? Huh? Ah, yeah. Better. Okay, then I'll just start again. Um, hi, I'm Jonas, and I'm running my own mail server. That's why I want to get notified when it breaks down, because then I cannot receive any mail, which is not good. Um, and therefore, I implemented the mail exporter. What the mail exporter does is basically uh, I give it just a list of external SMTP servers, and then it periodically just sends email over those ex uh, SMTP servers to myself and then just sees if the mail arrives in time, in a timeout that I can specify. You can see that on the, here on the uh, top left, that is the deliver success, that uh, looks for the five uh, servers I have in place quite good. And if, that is, uh, if one of the mails doesn't, uh, doesn't arrive in time, then that just goes from one to zero, and I can see, ah, there is a problem. The nice thing about that is I can kind of distinguish how severe things are, because when one of the external SMTP service is not able to deliver, then this might be a problem on the other side. If zero of my five uh, external SMTP servers are able to deliver, then the problem might be more on my side. Uh, I also, when a mail runs into timeout, I also track uh, if it comes anywhere after. So if I see that uh, a mail uh, that the mail delivery in time failed, but there is a late mail on that server afterwards, I can guess that it was probably a mail that was just late. What it also does is uh, it measures t the times, the round trip times that uh, the, mail, the mail takes. For example, the entire delivery duration from sending until receiving, which is a little bit spiky at the moment, or at least in that screenshot. And it also, um, it also tracks the send durations, which is basically the time uh, of the handshake that... Uh, the, uh, the time it takes to hand off the mail to the external SMTP server. Um, so that I can see if the if the send duration, if the handshake took long, or if the actual delivery took long, and how long they took. Um, and yeah, that's basically how I can sleep at night because I know when something breaks down, then I get notified because I have my metrics there. In the uh, at the bottom, you also see a different metric which is similar to the overall delivery success, which is the um, basically the success of, of sending or the, the fails of, of sends, because when the other mail server does not, uh, or I cannot connect to the other mail server for some reason, that is not technically a delivery failure because I couldn't even hand something over to deliver, but you would also want to um, alert on that because if that happens uh, for a long time, then there might also be a problem. Are there any questions? If not, there is, the, uh, there is the URL if you want to take a look at the software, and otherwise, thank you for your attention.